One math problem that's been studied for a long time is how to cut up a square into squares of smaller sizes. It's been known for a long time that you can't do this with cubes. There's no way to cut up any cube of any size into smaller cubes of distinct sizes. The puzzle I'm challenging is the same thing, but for a slightly different shape than a cube. That's where the wannabe cube comes in. So a cube is a rectangular prism where all three dimensions are the same number. A wannabe cube is a rectangular prism where all three dimensions are consecutive numbers. So the first wannabe cube is 1 by 2 by 3, then 2 by 3 by 4, 3 by 4 by 5, 4 by 5 by 6, so on and so forth. And right here, we have a perfectly good wannabe cube dissection. So you can start with the first two wannabe cubes, glue them together, then glue on the third wannabe cube and the fourth. And if you glue together on the right faces, the final shape you're left with is the fifth wannabe cube. I worked on this for a while and couldn't find any examples other than this one. So the challenge is to either find another example of a wannabe cube dissection or to give some explanation as to why this is the only one if it is. There's also a few variations you could explore here. So you could change your restriction on the squared squares problem. So instead of having to have distinct sizes of squares inside, you can have duplicates but at most two duplicates of any one size. Another variation you could explore that you can't with the squared square and cubed cubes problem is different rotations of the shape. So obviously rotating a square, spinning a cube around still leaves you with the same cube, but wannabe cubes are not the same shape after being rotated. So you could tackle this problem counting each of these as distinct shapes as well. This video is just the challenge. Next week I'll post the solution. Thanks for watching.